Hi everybody, it's Sally from Sally Stampers. Just a quick one today to tell you all about our new Kling stamp. So, as you may or may not be aware, Stampin' Up! have bought some new stamps to us that are, I'm just going to see if I can find one and I'm not going to have one to hand, am I? Everyone I pick up is photopolymer. So, as you know, we have, oh my goodness, seriously, I will find one, here we have, so, so in the past we have, this is just one I've grabbed off my shelf, clear mount stamps, so we have the gorgeous red rubber, and I, some people do these differently, but I always stuck my clear backing onto my lid, and then stuck that in, because I found that the, the this stuck better than the actual sticker. Um, so these are no longer being done, so as of the spring summer catalogue we are getting cling stamps. So they're exactly the same with the red rubber but they're even better now. So they now come with an adhesive labelled image that will actually cling really well to your clear blocks. So initially you need to know how to um, prep them if you like. So this is one of the stamp sets I was lucky enough to receive it on stage. This was my prize patrol um, which basically is a free giveaway to people who have a certain number on their badge or a certain colour on their badge. Um, so this was the one I won. Um, they come exactly the same as the previous one so we have our stickers here and then our lovely red rubber. Um, but obviously they do say now at the top cling stamp so I'm just going to show you very briefly the, the difference with these so I'm going to go with it's your day because that's quite a simple one to spot and then here is my sticker and if you can see you can just work out the word day there so previously I would have peeled the whole of this off taken the backing off and then gone under here and stuck it onto the back of my box but I'm not doing that anymore because you don't need to with these cling stamps they are amazing so spot where your label is so as I said it's just here and we are just going to take the backing off the clear bit whilst it's still on this paper then we take the back off the stamp and just ensure that you've got the right stamp so make sure that it is the same wording let me zoom in a little bit and hope that this focuses because it's been playing up like crazy so come on then focus focus no shall we go out a little bit will that help you there we go fabulous so check that your wording is the same and then once you're happy what you need to do is, and I'm doing it this way just because it's easy for me to show you, I'm just lining this edge of the rubber up with this edge of the gap. So you can see that you have this camera, seriously. Come on, focus. No, it's not. Oh, there we go. So it has like a little edge, if you like, now where you've taken that layer out. And all you simply need to do is line it up in the space give it a little press but then when you come to take it off you need to peel from the side okay so you peel it off and there is your stamp it's not going to focus there we go so that is your stamp now you might notice that I've got a little bit of excess over the edge if my camera will blink in focus there's a tiny little bit over the edge here but I'm not too worried about that and then literally you will just pop it in your case. I'll zoom back out before my camera has a complete nut of meltdown. So you just pop it in your case. When you come to adhere it to a block you need to again peel from one corner and pop it on your block. So then you will ink it, stamp it, do whatever you need to do, give it a scrub and a clean, and then when you come to take it off, you peel it and put it back in its box. And that is it, clink mount stamps. So you are taking the backing off, taking the backing off your rubber stamp, 
sticking it onto there and then peeling. If you remember that peeling method, then obviously that will help. Um, do it slowly, don't do it too quickly. Um, the foam will tear, so the, this foam will tear. If you, if you try and pull it off too quick, it will just tear because the cling is that strong. Okay, and you can either um, clean the labels by rinsing them under running water. So if the sticky gets mucky, you can just run them under some water, some cold water, and just leave them to dry, and they should be okay. So clear mount stamps, they are fabulous, they are amazing, and hopefully you will enjoy them too. That was just a little quick video from me to show you about the beautiful new cling mount stamps. Hope it's helpful, hope it's given you um, a bit of ideas of how to do yours when you receive them. Um, I hope to see you all again soon. Bye!